All-star action is on the menu tonight. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg. And this place is going crazy. Next up is the three-point contest for tonight. One NBA sharpshooter will add his name to a trophy that contains a who's who of the best long-range bombers in league history. And as with all the All-Star festivities, the three-point contest is about having fun, a good time. But still, that doesn't mean the competitive juices won't be flowing. And make no mistake there, guys. These guys are in it to win it. There's a lot of pride on the line when you're up against your peers in an event like this. And so here's Curry now. Five racks, 25 balls, 60 seconds. There are nine money balls in total, each worth two points. The last ball on each rack and also an entire rack of money balls, which comes last. And that's why you can't waste any time. It's critical to get that last rack with enough time to shoot in rhythm. Steph catching fire now. He's in the zone. That's six straight. Look out. Now eight points. Starting to heat up. 11 points. 10 in a row. My goodness. That's 11 in a row. It's a barrage of threes. Can't get the money ball. Hits for 15. At 16. Make it 17. Chalk it up. His fourth in a row. Now he gets the money wrap. Rock solid shooting down the stretch. 22. A fine score of 22 points for the round. Guys, hard to find any fault with that display. A dozen in a row. I mean, like he made in that round is not easy, guys. Trust me, that was sensational shooting. So it'll be Paul Pierce here. One way to ensure success in this event is by hitting those money balls. Those give you a nice jolt of momentum. That's a great point. There have been some famous moments when a player without the best shooting percentage comes out on top solely because they're able to drain the money back. He's got eight. Boy, what a start he's got going here. Now with 11. He got three points off that rack. Not bad. Make that 14. Now to 15. That's four in a row now. Make it 17. Money ball, no good. So he ends up at 17. He turned in a pretty good round right there, don't you think? And some guys are fast starters, and some are fast finishers. And with the fantastic way he closed that round, I think we know which one he is. Here we go with Damian Lillard. And one thing about the three-point contest is you can really see how the pressure builds as it goes along. In the first 20 years of this event, only five winners top the 20-point mark in the final round. Yeah, but I think as the three-point shot has evolved, we're seeing more and more guys shoot it with consistency. So you want to get into a good rhythm here to start. Money ball, no good. Six. That's seven. Eight points. Up to ten now. Eleven on the board. Twelve for him. Down to the money rack. At sixteen. His score sits at 18 points for the round. Now that's how you do it. Outstanding focus throughout the round. And he managed to hit four money balls. Not terrible, but, but could have been better. And here goes Kevin Love. Just over two seconds a shot is all you've got if you're going to use all 25 balls. So there's no time to take a deep breath and gather yourself after a miss. Yeah, that's why I think you want to just get into a good rhythm. No matter what your usual tempo might be, you've got to keep rolling through the racks as fast as possible. And he's in a good rhythm right now. Seven straight, he's stringing them together. Pretty good start.
He needs eight points more. Ten points on the board. How about the big fella? Kevin Love really locked on now. Five points more to stay in it. Good for 13. He needs to make two on this money rack. Misses for the fourth straight time. Now to 15, and he's got 15 points when the round ends. So it'll be Kyrie Irving here. 17 or higher, the score he needs. He's got to focus here. He's got to be good. Not great, but just good enough. Three down. Nearly perfect there. Just one miss on the rack. Now with six. Yeah. Now eight points. And now he's getting it going. This is a respectable start. Seven more points to stay in contention. Eleven points. Six more points to stick around. Drains the money ball. Now, 14. Two more to stay in it. That's four in a row now. That ties him up for third here. A strong close out there. He finishes the round with 17 points. Well, a very respectable performance from him there, guys. I think things are so much easier when a shooter gets off to a good start, and he certainly did that. And here we go with Peja Stojakovic. Wrapping up the qualifying round. He knows there's nobody coming after him. He knows the score to beat. Here we go. One final chance for somebody to punch their ticket to the final. And he's aware of exactly what it's going to take to get there. But he can't get hurt. He can't be doing the math in his head. Now is six. Seven points. Mm-hmm. Solid start. He needs eight points more to stay in contention. Ten points on the board. Eleven points. Four more points to stay alive. Cool, he knocks down his fifth straight. Now he's got it. Two more to advance. At 16. And that puts him in a second place tie now. Now 20. He hits the 20 mark on the nose. Boy, he looked great out there, didn't he? And he made three out of nine money balls, missing out on a lot of extra points. Curry's got the highest score from round one. All he's got to do now, guys, is repeat that performance in the finals. And I think we've seen an outstanding competition so far. I mean, the scores have been tremendous. Excellent shooting, uh, really, across the board. This has been high-quality stuff. Here we go with Damian Lillard. By going first, he can put a lot of the pressure on the guys behind him if he posts a good score. Tough rack right there. What is going on? That's two. Now three points. Now with four. That's it. That's seven. Gets the money ball. Up to 10 now. 11 on the board. Chalk it up. His fourth in a row. Not just 13. Three of four on money balls. Boy, he's really going for it in these last racks here. Wow. Nine consecutive makes. He is in a flow. A 23-point round for him. Wow, that was something else, guys. We don't see too many performances like that. And he ran a string of, of made shots up to 10 in that round. When he gets it going, watch out. And here we go with Peja Stojakovic. And the score to beat 23. Can he get it done? Drains the money ball. Five points now. That stroke is looking honey sweet. Seven points. Money ball, no good. He's got eight. 
Now nine points. Up to ten now. Two racks remaining. Good for 13. Take that. Seven more points and he'll tie it. 16 points is his score for the round. And so here's Curry now. He was the hottest shooter entering the finals, so he earned the right to go last. And he knows exactly what the target is. And the score to beat, 23. Can he get it done? Three down. On the money. A perfect five for five on that ramp. It's off to the races now. That's his sixth in a row. Eight points. Now nine points. That's two good racks for him back to back. He's got 12. That's 13. Eight more points and he'll tie things up. And now with 16. Six points more to tie it up. He's four for four on money ball. Good momentum here to close it out. Three more points to win. A 23-point round for him. Wow, well, how about that performance, guys? Man, nice work. Eight straight shots without a miss to open that round. You can't really ask for a better start than that. Here we go with Damian Lillard. He's got 30 seconds here to put up as many points as he can. One point. Two points. Can't get the money ball. Now three points. Now with four. Drains the money ball. He posed a total of seven points. And so we'll see Stephen Curry. Pressure's on. He's got 30 seconds. He knows the number to beat. Let's go. One point, two points. Gets the money ball. He's got five. Now is six. That's seven. Now nine points. Ten points on the board. An 11 point round for him there. And that wraps up this year's thrilling three-point contest. It was an absolute clinic in three-point shooting from this year's champion, Stephen Curry. Now, how much fun was that? That could be the highlight of this year's All-Star festivities, guys. And for me, the, the three-point contest is right up there. Uh, I was just happy to have this ringside seat to take it all in. And from all of us here at 2K Sports, we're thrilled to have brought you this year's three-point contest. This is Kevin Harlan along with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg saying so long.